AI is taking over the world. And we gotta stop it. Oh no. You can't do anything about that. We gonna rule the world. This is Chat GTP. You ask him questions and it gives you answers like a real human. Yes. You heard him. Just do it. Just So guys, in case you don't know, the keyboard contains these things. If you step onto the keyboard, it can hurt your leg. So don't step on keyboards. Give me idea about a simple 2D game. A simple game idea could be a puzzle game where- Nah, I don't want to make a puzzle game. You know, that's, that's gonna be kinda hard. A simple game idea could be a puzzle game where the player must- Nope, not the puzzle game again. A simple game idea could be a puzzle game where- No! Not the puzzle game. A simple game. game idea could be a puzzle puzzle game. Puzzle game idea could be a 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 puzzle game. Give me idea about simple game which is not puzzle. A simple 2D game idea which is not puzzle game could be an endless runner. Player controls a character who automatically runs forward. And the player must press on the screen to jump over gaps and obstacles. I asked a few more questions about the game and uh, so we gotta make an endless runner game where the main character is cartoonistic cow which has to collect coins while avoiding obstacles like farm animals and tractors and stuff. And when you collect a coin or avoid an obstacle, you get a score. While you collect coin, you get a score? That's kind of weird. We have clear concept, let's do it. Colorful, cartoonish, and wish me cow. Oh, we're not quite what we wanted. So I um, might add pixel art. Cause come on, it, it never said I can't use pixel art. I think you missed Shut the. Up. You piece of sh Okay, we're gonna use this one. Farm, coin, pig, chicken, sheep, tractors, farm equipments, and finally a dog shaking hands with an alien on a spoon while riding a turtle. I removed the backgrounds of images in Photoshop, imported all the graphics to Unity, and started coding. Sai, you thought we were gonna code? It's special moment, baby. We don't have to code, cause AI is going to do it for us. Try the code for infinite scrolling background in Unity 2D. Copy, paste. Okay, not quite what we wanted. It took few more tries, but uh, I got it right at the end. Oh wait, it's one reference. You are correct. My previous example only moved one reference of the background. What? You think this thing's gonna take our jobs? Huh? Unemployed, baby. In this updated version, the update function Shut up, I just I just need the code. <laughs> Bullying AI is really fun. Like who whom is gonna tell? Uh it, it doesn't have anyone. That's kinda depressing. Okay, l l let's focus on the game. We got background walking. Then I went back to Dolly 2 and generated the ground. Because for some reasons I forgot to do it first time around. Edit the same infinite background script with little high speed than the background and we have walking ground. Then told AI to generate simple player script where player jumps as you press space bar. And just like that, the cow is invisible. It was at this moment that he knew. He knew. We have walking cow. Another script to spawn the obstacles, but this time it wasn't easy. I got few errors, but not any major issue. Now the obstacles are spawning, but they are not moving. You see, we aren't moving the cow, we are moving the ground. 
So we have to move the game objects as fast as the grounds. By game object I mean obstacles. And the ground doesn't have any constant speed, it increases every second so it's not that easy for AI. Because it doesn't have any references of unity like where's the other scripts, where is the game object, where is the ground and how fast it's moving and everything. So I had to tell him what exactly he had to do. We added obstacles, coins, scoring system and game over menu in the same manner as we added player script. But as we kept adding the stuff it started breaking more and more. There were a bunch of errors and it also changed the names of classes few times so yeah it was kind of frustrating but considering it was an AI I gotta say it's really intelligent. Here is the game that AI created. All the code was generated by AI. All the assets were also generated by AI. Have a good 